Hi guys and welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. I really do appreciate it so very much. Welcome, my name is Aiden. I'm so happy that you're here. I have a Victoria's Secret uh, pink haul. It's mostly pink. I got this tote, which I think is super cute. Anyway, I went in, I was at the mall, I was shopping. I hadn't been in a mall for a while and it was just fun to look around. And I was like, oh, I wanna smell the new scents. And then it was a pink Friday, which who knew that was a thing? Anyway, all of the body care in pink was five for 30. They, I also remembered that I had a 30 off of a $100 coupon. So I went in there, I did get some sweatpants. I got a shirt, a t-shirt as well. And then I got what's in here. I went back to another store, hoping that they had a sweatshirt that I really wanted in my size. They didn't. It says Sundays are the best days. It has a little football in it. It's black. I got the t-shirt, the gray t-shirt version of it. And I got some shorts at the other one. Uh, because I was looking at uh, the different sale items everywhere. Anyway, uh, th that's kind of what was going on. I had a 10 off of 40 and a 30 off of 100, and I used both of those coupons. So let's start with what I picked up at Pink. I started with this collection. I picked up Peach Swirl, which is white peach, whipped coconut, and tan lines. This is the one that I was not sure of as much. I'm getting the peach. I think I'm liking it better now that I'm smelling it than when I was in store because it was I was probably overwhelmed to be honest because I was smelling so many different things. And then I also picked up cotton candy. This is strawberry sugar, fluffy vanilla, and boardwalk air. This one is nice. This does not have that really airy note that some of the Bath and Body Works air notes have that I don't like on my skin. There's something about it that just makes me feel a little icky. That's the best way I can describe it. But that one doesn't, so I'm very happy with that one. This one I'm kind of regretting not buying too. This is Rocket Pop. This is Cherry Ice, Sunshine Lemon, and Blue Raspberry. I actually wonder if they had this in a lotion. I would totally buy this in a lotion. Mmm, this is so much more berry and cherry than Firecracker Pop. I like this one more. This one is so good. Yes, I really love that one. But then I turned to the fall and, um, well actually no, I also picked up mango. This one is not was not available online. I don't think the peach was either. And this is just a mango scent. This smells so good. It's so tropical. Mm, really nice. So I, I got that one as well. I was very excited about that. Now let's turn to the fall. So first up, I got Pink Apple. This is another one that I thought was really nice. It's apple-y. Um, I don't know, I just, I, I do love apple scents. I love my fruity scents. So apple is a good scent. Mm. And I liked it so much, I was gonna get the body butter in it. But then I realized, I picked up this one, not realizing that this was the body scrub. So, yeah, that's that's where we are. So I picked up a body scrub instead of a body butter. That's fine. I will use the body scrub. But I was like, oh, I didn't realize they were in the same packaging. And I just grabbed it from the wrong pile. Things happen. It's fine. They were 420 I think, with my discount. If I remember right, which I don't think I left the receipt. No, I took the receipt out. I also have two coupons for a free mist or lotion and 20 off 50 if I can remember to use them in September, that's that's the problem. Like I have several of those bounce back, like to box lunch and to Gap and everything else. Speaking of Apple, I also picked up Apple Rush. So this is Honey Crisp Apple Pink Clouds and Caramel Vanilla. Now you might be have noticed that this is more than five. Yes, I, I bought 10 items. These apples are different. This one's a little bit sweeter has a little bit more of a gourmand feel to it than an apple feel, but it still has that apple, if that makes sense. And I did pick up the matching lotion in this. I know some people don't love their lotions. I've been wearing the Vanilla and Dreamy and really loving it, the pop one, and I've been really enjoying it this summer, so I was like, I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. And then I also picked up O Cherry. This is Dark Cherry Red Pomegranate and Vanilla Amber. I was worried this was gonna be like a dupe of Lost Cherry. It's similar, but it's different. There's enough of a difference. It's not as 
it doesn't have that liqueur feel the same way. But, and I think the pomegranate just gives it a little bit more uh, fruitiness. So I'm, I'm happy with this. And I did get the matching lotion because of course I'm gonna get the matching lotion because it's cherry and we know that I love cherry. That's why I wish Rocket Pop would have had um, that. This tote was free with purchase. So I think it's a fairly nice one. It has pockets on both sides. Inside it has another pocket and it has a snap enclosure. So I was like, oh, that's a fairly nice one. It's supposed to be like a retail of $50. I'm sorry, not a retail of $50. But I felt like I got a pretty good deal with what I bought. You know, I got 10 body care items, sweatpants and a t-shirt and the tote for $76 with tax. I thought that was a pretty good deal. My next deal was not quite as good, but I still had fun. Um, I got shorts and a t-shirt, like I said, and then I picked up three of the travel sprays. These are buy two, get one free, and I had my 10 off of 40, so I did that. So I picked up Bombshell Escape. This one has like guava, oh, it says on the back, thank goodness. Juicy Guava, Sun Summer Glow Peony, and Lush Palms. I like this one. It's a little bit saltier. I feel like there's a saltiness to it. That's a little bit more than I normally go for, but I did pick up that one. I also picked up Bear. This was my third pick, and I was kind of struggling trying to decide what I wanted to get. And I remember Veronica, um, I think Veronica from Veronica says, really likes this one. And so I was like, well, let's try this one. Ooh, that did not want to press straight. Yeah, I think this is a nice one. Um, more of an everyday scent has a little sweetness to it, but not not a whole bunch if that makes sense And then the last one was one that I think I'm gonna get. Oh, I should tell you notes bear is Australian sandalwood Egyptian violet and Mandarin Madagascar Shouldn't it be Madagascar or Mandarin? I don't know The last one I got was sugar fleur teas and this is one I think I probably want to get a full size of eventually um but I didn't want to spend that right now. I'm hoping to find a deal. Uh, the notes on this are fresh apple, jasmine buds, and pink caramel. And this is gonna be my scent, scent of the day today. Watch, I spray it and then I'm like, I hate it. Uh, that would be me. But I definitely get that apple. The jasmine is there a little bit, just to give it a little bit of depth, but there's also that caramel. It's just really good. I, I am really enjoying this. Um, I smelled it in store and I was thinking about it. So I went to the second store. I was like, that's one of the things I need to get is the teas. And then I also wanted the bombshell escape. So that's it for my Victoria's Secrets pink haul. Let me know if you have been, um, if you've tried any of the scents. I also, side note, I also did try all of the ones in Victoria's Secret, all of the fall ones. The one store had the soles and I didn't get a chance to smell them. I should have, but uh, the other store didn't have them. So I did smell a lot of them and there, there were some nice ones, but nothing that blew me away. Nothing that I was like, oh, I really want it like I found in the pink side. So I am going to uh, wait on those. If I get a chance, I might try to smell the soles if I go to another store. Anyway, I hope you're all having a fantastic day. Thank you so much for watching and I can't wait to talk to you next time. Bye.